and welcome to my lovely VW van. What do you think? Yes, this is a Volkswagen Transporter Combi. Uh, T32 short wheelbase, 180 DSG. Yes, and it's a lovely van. I like my VW vans. I like the camper vans as well, you know, the old fashioned type. But yeah, these are fantastic. What I like even more about it is that I could hook my phone into this. And I like that. So all the music that's on my phone plays through the tape player. Now that's pretty cool, I think. Yes. Also, you can ring people. See, I'm not really in the 21st century with gizmos and gadgets like this. Look, it says Adele's iPhone. How cool is that? That's really cool though, isn't it? Obviously, you can't ring yourself, so I can't show you. Radio, you get all of these, but you can program them. <laughs> it goes a bit loud, the radio does. <laughs> you can program in up to 10 radio stations. These are ones that have already been put in. Media, you find whichever one. Like I said, I'm on my phone, which is good. Uh, voice, the voice you need an activation key for. Uh, traffic it tells you all the traffic reports and thanks to um, Storm Doris there's a lot a lot a lot of traffic reports <laughs> Storm Doris is really kicking our butts today um, we get to do navigation so it tells you where you are and then you put in where you want to go basically it's just a sat nav built in which obviously uh, points of interest as well if you wanted to gas stations parking lots restaurants so forth and so forth menu I haven't played a menu so these are app connects that you can connect up, which is good. Obviously radio and all them ones. But we'll go back to media. We'll just leave it on that for a minute. Because so I got my, my lovely Moana playing. It also, yeah, th this was a good one because I keep winding Mr. Producer up with this one. So that one is for my seat. So now Mr. Producer is going to get a nice warm tush. And this one is for this seat. So he, I keep putting Mr. Producers on and he doesn't realise so his bum gets hot. <laughs> Sorry, yes, it's, it's quite funny. But yeah, you can do parking sensors on it. It's got it all around it, front and back. So if you press that button, they come on look. So you, there's your sensors. You've got two, four at the back, two on the side. Same on the front. But it looks safe to move. So you listen to the computer. If the computer thinks it's safe to move, you move. Simple as that. But yeah. That was my boot falling off the side. So we'll turn the parking sensors off. And I don't know about Mr. Producer's bum, but my bum's getting a bit warm. Is your bum getting a bit warm, Mr. Producer? Should we turn them down or turn them off? <laughs> so we'll, look, you can turn them down, the heat on the bum as well. So yes, you get your usual air con, which I've turned off because it's getting very hot. Um, it's an automatic, which is quite interesting to watch Mr. Producer. <laughs> So obviously Mr. Producer drives me around, he's my chauffeur, yeah. I don't do the driving, I do the sitting and the moaning. No, I don't moan, I'm the navigator. So I'm going to be a bit redundant actually, because he's got a sat nav built in. <laughs> but yes, it's an automatic, which is good fun, because Mr. Producer's having to keep his foot tight in so he doesn't use it for his clutch. So yes, it's a combi van, obviously I've said that, but that means you get the two front seats, and three in the back but then you get some space for a work van as well at the back and it's a high roof one so it means you can't go in any car parks <laughs> with a bollard across because you'll leave half your roof rack with it yeah yeah it's quite good i don't think this has got the sunglasses holder oh that one is a sunglass holder there look so you pull that down put your sunglasses in uh you've got your visor with the mirror in in some vans i've noticed they have like holders on this for your cds but if you have your phone going through, you don't really need it, do you? Yeah, 12 volt switch there. Oh yeah, because that's normally with the gear stick, isn't it? Your cigarette thing to charge your phone up. Oh, it also has a USB point there for charging and a headphone set there for when I just want my music on for me <laughs> and not for Mr. Producer. Um, I'm not sure what else to show. That's my bottle of Vimto that I drank over there. I think that's everything. Should we have a walk around the van, Mr. Producer? So stop filming a second while we get out because I think Storm Doris might blow us away. So that might be quite funny actually. Keep recording me until I get out. That might be quite good. Turn that up. Well, it also tells you when you turn the radio off, sorry, just di diversing a minute. It says, please remember to take your phone with you. 
because my phone's hooked up into it, you see. So it's quite good that. But yes, I'm going to try, and I mean try, and get out. I'm going to turn the car on first, because that'd be quite funny. I take the keys with me. Or do you want the keys, Mr. Producer? Then I don't lose them. Right, I've got to be careful of my door being blown off. Come on then, let's have a wander. <laughs> Can't open it though, can I? Show everybody what's happening for today. <laughs> no, I'm not trying on the clothes. <laughs> this storm, Doris, is really windy. So yes, this is the boot with your two spanking door. One. Oh yeah, when um, we stop, you know, like the roundabout thing like that, the end of the town, and it keeps freaking me out. Big style. Good new tyres, of course. So this door opens up into the three back seats. Yeah, the lovely back seats. The ISO fix ones as well. So if you have an ISO fix child baby seat kind of thing, there's things in there that you can slide in and click your baby car seat in. These new gadget, gadgets and gadgets again. But yeah, it's all safety. There's no covers on the windows, but the windows do slide back. Just pull the, that bit there, and it slides back. Look, hello. And you slide it back again without breaking your hand. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Do you want to go around and have a look at the front or are we going around the back again? Go around the back again. But it's a nice pretty car. Oh, well, transporter. Oh, I really thought you were going to trip over the curb then. That would have been funny. Do you want to look at this side as well, Mr. Bruce? to look what's in my shopping bags that's for later. Mr. Producer's left and pull all my rubbish. <laughs> but yeah, there's a shelf at the top. I'm not sure from when that's a mid sleeper because I don't think it's this design that needs a mid sleeper. Why do I have to get it? There's no handles to get in with. There really isn't. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> I get that cold. Hello. So, yes, there's three sizes to the window opening. That's the widest. And that one. And there's another one. And they're really good. I like BW transporters. I got out without falling over. I'm quite I'm quite proud of myself. And this is the front. It looks a bit like a panther with how the eyes are I think yeah it's a nice vehicle it's a bit high to what I'm used to because like I said with car parts you can't really get in with bollards and things so you have to be really really careful with that and there's a train going past <laughs>